Filipinos are unfortunately known as perennial last-minute shoppers. That's why it comes as no surprise that many brave the jam-packed streets of Divisoria just to get the most value for their money to purchase the much-needed school supplies for upcoming class opening. Tati Villanda supplies the details. One day before the first day of school, last-minute shoppers went to Divisoria today. Just like Lily Beth, who preferred to buy school supplies for her three kids, hoping prices went down today. Bakit ngayon ka lang na bimili, ate? Last-minute shopping. Alam mo naman ang mga Pilipino. <laughs> last-minute shopping. Opo. Eh, di kaya mas nakamakal ka nun sa last Hindi po, kasi nung nakaraan din po, nagpunta rin po ako dito, nag-canvas ako, mas mahal po siya kaysa ngayon. She budgeted 1,500 pesos for the school supplies of her three children and ended up paying only 670 pesos because she already bought notebooks last week. Magana? 670 po. Oh, congratulations, Ate, pa sa budget. <laughs> Opo. Nandiyan na ba lahat? Opo. Meron pa pong kulang yung ano nila. Anong kulang? Mga tumbler nila. According to sellers, one can save money if they buy wholesale. Spring notebooks can be bought for 380 pesos for 10 pieces, 280 pesos for ordinary, and 200 pesos for a set of 10 writing notebooks. File cases for 158 pieces are also best sellers, and plastic envelopes worth 75 pesos each. Notebook stickers are only 25 pesos for 16 pieces. For pencils, there are 100 pesos for 12 pieces and cheaper ballpens sell for 70 pesos for 12 pieces. Crayons can be bought from 35 pesos to 350 pesos depending on the numbers of colors. According to sellers, their prices didn't go down because of the lack of supply. So dati po ma'am, hindi po mababa yung an namin ma'am yung price kasi wala pong stock. Kaya tumaas po talaga yung ano niya ma'am yung price. Sinasabihan ko lang po sila ma'am na ano, dito na lang po kayo bumibili kasi bigyan ko po kayo ng discount. Kaso, liba lang po. <laughs> That's why Reggie regrets she didn't buy enough school supplies online. Ito na lang yung kulang, yung mga notebook na pamili ko na nung una kasi mahirap pagsabay-sabay. Ah okay. Eh ngayon last minute ah, kamusta naman yung presyo? Mas mahal po kaysa nung una. Ah, okay. Opo, kaya, Bakit nung dati? Akala ko kasi pag mas dito, mas mura. May, may, mas mura din pala pag mga Shopee, ganun. But others are selling their products at a lower price to earn more before school opens tomorrow. Uniforms are only sold 140 pesos from the previous 170 pesos each set. Minsan pag-anin pang homesale na rin, patatenga na yung ibang stock. Siyempre, peperahin na lang din. Meanwhile, prices of school supplies in Divisoria are expected to drop even lower once school starts, but depending on the supply. Karen Villanda for The Nation.